to jump on and I am actually recording this so that I can share it with people who are not on Facebook because about half of our team is not on Facebook. I am excited to walk through some of the changes that I've seen since the last time I recorded. And the other thing that I wanted to do was jump on my phone so I can kind of show you what's different on my mobile phone between the app and using the Chrome app, which I do a lot, and why. So let me start my screen sharing. I am going to just do the desktop to start with, and then I will do my phone. So you'll notice that our managed business has changed since we did this last. The dashboard is in two places. You've got, oh goodness gracious, my mouse is sensitive. You got the dashboard right here, and you also have a shortcut dashboard right here. In the managed business, there's a whole lot of stuff rearranged from when we first started, which is amazing. And the thing that that shows me is that Avon is really listening to us. They are moving things and adding things that make it easier. So for anyone who has not connected to the Avon wallet so that you get your profits from any online sales and for leaders, any profits from leadership, you're going to want to make sure that you set up the Avon wallet. So you just click here. It is going to give you the information about getting paid. And I will definitely say that I'm excited to see that we're getting paid faster and I'm getting more tracking emails that tell me when the payments are coming. So I think that's actually fantastic. I did notice that featured and special offers actually kind of came outside of the drop down, which makes it really nice so that you've got your stuff. I know that our invoices are still not showing all of these specials and applying the free items quite correctly. So this way, as you see them on your invoice, you can come back here and check. Now, one of the things I do is I will go through and look at this a lot. And then I will, as I'm filling out my, uh, in, or my customer invoices, then I'm going to, uh, add those free things in just by popping in and add the product and, and fill it in and not fill any price in. So that makes it really easy for me when I go to print everything out and I have that with me. Um, the wait list, I think, is one of those things that that's still evolving because I will put stuff on the wait list and then I will get emails that say it's in. And by the time I get back out here, and put it in my cart since I only order on the first Sunday of the campaign, then it's already out again. And anyway, so just kind of take those emails with a grain of salt. It will stay on your wish list, wait list until you take it off and add it to your, your bag. So that's good. All righty. Um, this has been rearranged a little bit. I noticed that if I shrink my screen that sometimes things hide, but we can always find it. If you hadn't signed up for the LG Partner Store, you have access to it right here. This allows us all of those great discounts on major appliances and that is fantastic. I know one of the things that I've been looking at is the possibility I think I've finally given up the idea of having one of those robot vacuums because I just have too much craziness, but I think I want one of those cordless vacuums and LG makes a pretty decent one. So, and there's like a 50 or hundred dollars savings if you order it through the partner store. So I'm kind of excited about that. I'm looking forward to that. Make sure that you get a chance to get in here and explore all of these. So don't forget Avon News up here. And there is so much in here for you to look at, explore, get those extra badges so that you start getting more product knowledge. 
But I will tell you, I had an amazing day today. I had gotten a customer referral and the poor lady called me and asked me um, if she, I had fragrances that I could get to her before her birthday on Friday. So I threw a little kit of stuff together, put prices on everything and took the kit over to her to give her an opportunity to smell some things and decide what she wanted. She ended up with artisan, the artisan cherry, rare diamonds, and I gave her a free um, travel size haiku that I had just to kind of make it interesting. And then we were talking about some of the other products. Her daughter went ahead and placed an order. She has four daughters and she's going to try to get them together so that we can have an, an Avon party. I was just, it, it was fun. It's fun. And understanding the products so that you can talk to somebody about those products is exactly what Avon New is all about. So now here's one of the other things that I learned. I'm going to stop sharing, but I need to go back and I need to actually log out because I have noticed that it is smart and it knows where you are logged in. And so if I try to log in on my phone, it, it kind of glitches on me to where there is some time that it goes and then it kind of logs you out, may not be completely logging you out. So I've known noticed that I just go in and I hit the sign out, I refresh the screen, and then I go back in. And that, that works for me. Because if I'm gone too long on a different tab, any of those, then suddenly it's like, okay, this is not the right page you're trying to log on to something that you're not allowed to because it's looking at me like I'm just an outside customer that hasn't even logged in. So that's one of those that we have to be careful of. So, all right. So I am going to share my mobile now. Hey there, and I'm back. So instead of being able to share my screen using AirPlay because it didn't seem to want to go any deeper into the phone. I am going to share my screen as part of the Zoom meeting since I am logged in. Okay. Since I am logged in to, with my phone as well as the computer. So, but I don't have the microphone on. And I'm very excited to get out of there. Okay, so I have both the app for the iPhone as well as the Chrome app that I use because I use Chrome on multiple computers and my phone and I get to keep everything in sync, which means that it allows me to do some extra stuff. So I had already logged in. Um, and so it kept it in, and this is what you can see in the mobile. You'll notice that the difference between the uh, desktop and the mobile is obviously how much screen real estate that you have. This little, um, this little, what they call the hamburger menu up here in the corner is where a lot more information is available. This is where we have Avon Rewards, Avon U, Vibe for leaders. If you're not a leader, you won't see Vibe, but you'll find that where you can shop by product. You've got all of the digital stuff here and you can scroll down. You can go to the buzz and check those out. You can go back to that menu. You can go into the My Store or the My Profile and do all of that stuff. Maybe time to change my picture, I don't know. I love the fact that it tells me that how long I've been in Avon and some of my personal information is all right there. I know that not everybody can do the mobile app. So, so what I wanna do is go back to there and I want to sign out. Now, the reason that I'm doing the sign out process is because what I have noticed between the desktop app and logging in on the Chrome app 
is that if I'm logged in in too many places, it definitely does not like it and it gets confused. I found it very interesting to um, listen to Molly Bibb today and she was talking about things that she likes, things that she doesn't like. We're all learning. We're all taking time to go through and figure some stuff out. And for those who have the ability like me to record myself, to screen share, to do all this stuff, I am trying to make sure that everybody gets an opportunity to see how the system works. And as we learn new things, I'm gonna definitely be sharing them. So you can see here, I am definitely a shop by product kind of person. I like being able to put in either the numbers or the um, product. that gives me the opportunity to kind of scan through some of these, see where there might be some things that I'm looking for. You know, like this one, I had a customer who needs that um, as part of that order with my fragrance visit. And so you can see that it's very easy to add to next campaign or add to order. I think, that I find this very interesting. If you want to get back to the home screen, I'm just touching this Avon uh, uh, symbol here and that gets me back. You'll see that I have something added to my cart. Unlike the desktop, which stuffs the cart over on the far right-hand side and kind of shoots it down, it's a little easier, I think, in some ways to see it on the mobile. Um, so I will end up doing both things. You know, I think that you need to work your business wherever you are. If you have a desktop, if you don't have a desktop, then you can do mobile all the time. And I'm going to go ahead and remove this because I'm placing my order in campaign six and I already put it in future orders. So you can see that I'm already getting ready for the things that I know. Now, this Kate testing is a customer that I had created a long time ago with a different email address, because yes, I'm one of those techies that has multiple email addresses, but I created this just to kind of put some things together and see some different viewpoints of our customer base and when I find a brand new customer like this person that I just went to visit, I don't have her email yet. I will get her email as part of delivering this next order. And then I will put her in there. But for now, I'm going to have recorded on a piece of paper her name, phone number, and the products that she wants. Because one of them I need to order and one I already have here because I've been trying to keep staying so soft here. If you have any questions about how to go through this on the mobile device, please let me know. I know that um, I may do stuff different than other people. I know that this all can be very confusing. If you've never done any of it, then it's all a learning curve. And you just need to click into the Avon U and make sure that you go through these modules so that you get an opportunity to really see some of the training. Now, I realize that some of this training is still old and it has the old website as a part of it. You just need to explore. And if you have questions, make sure you drop them either in Facebook or in email and let me know because I will be sending out a link to this email after I get all of this bundled together so that I can attach it to my YouTube channel and make sure that it's available for you guys to check out. So I think that's all I have for you. I'm going to go ahead and stop screen sharing there and I'm going to also go ahead and leave the meeting so that we don't have any competing stuff. So, um, woo!
I think that's all I have to say at this point. I will talk about the Happy Fragrance Kit. It was one of those things where I had an old makeup or an old Avon bag that I wasn't sure what to do with. And now I really like the idea that I can travel with some different fragrances and give people a chance to check them out without having to come. Because what was really interesting about this lady when I um, came to her home with her daughter is that she was in a wheelchair. So it's not like there was a whole lot of opportunity for her to meet me at an event or meet me at a store. And she was okay with me coming over and that worked. So I will talk to you all next time. Thanks. Bye. Thank you.